cocks. You can't handle the cocks sometimes, you know, Doa. Hello and welcome to Overwatch Apex Season 2. Today we have some great match. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Doa. <laughs> You're, you you're, you're voicing the next hero, right? I hope so. Man, that would be awesome. <laughs> Everybody tweet at Blizzard. Let them know. That was a pretty good depth sound. I have to give Thank it to you. Thank you. Hopefully, well done. I don't have to do it outside of a video game character performance anytime <laughs> soon. That's my hope. But I have another hope, Monte Cristo. And well, that if is it sad. happens, I hope it's recorded so we can use it later. <laughs> that's a, that's my last wish, yes. So my favorite, my favorite uh, reason for quitting games competitively, Doa, was in Warcraft 3, which I used to play, and cast. Uh, there was a problem where there was a menu shortcut, which was Alt QQ, which auto surrendered <laughs> you out of a game. Oh no. Okay, but the thing is, if you're a Night Elf player, as as all you old school Warcraft three players will know, there was a neutral hero uh, that was central to a lot of Night Elf strategies called the Beastmaster, uh -huh. and the Beastmaster could summon Quill Beasts, but you used Q. <laughs> And while you're microing, you had to hold Alt to see all health bars. So oh. frequently, you'd be holding Alt and spamming Q to summon your quill bores, and uh, <laughs> then you'd accidentally forfeit the game. Oh. It was great. It turned to quit bores. <laughs> it's one That's of my favorite sad. ways to lose. <laughs> that is harsh, man. It happened to human players sometimes, too, who, uh, who also used the Beastmaster in, in certain... Uh, in certain uh, strategies. So don't use a Beastmaster. The answer seems pretty pretty <laughs> obvious to <laughs> he me. Was I, so good I never really played Warcraft 3, <laughs> but I mean, I can see a pretty simple solution here. Oh. I could have just rebound the keys too, but I, I thought <laughs> losing was just more fun, I guess. Yeah, Alt-QQ. Alt-QQ. Turns into literal QQ. It, well, that's where it comes from, the QQ. Yeah. Well, it also looks like crying eyes. Yeah, that also yeah. is part of it. Yeah. But well. people, people back in the day in a lot of the, the old school Blizzard games would tell you to QQ, like, quit the game. <laughs> Well, we still got an audio issue. Waiting for Twilight to get his headset back. <laughs> They've taken it away from him. Oh, well. That's what happens when your headset, that's face Even you make when the headset <laughs> gets removed. That's right. Chicken is fun. You know what? We were, we were watching Twilight just sitting there in the booth. <laughs> All right. He's pretty good. But, and I was thinking to myself, I would rather watch the Overwatch player named Twilight sit there in the booth and do nothing than uh, watch any of the Twilight movies. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah. that's probably true, Doa. Yeah. I still haven't seen the Twilight movies, and I will never see them. So uh, you know, I will I will say I have had a lot of fun watching the Twilight movies because my friends and I we would do this way back when they came out because on it, DVD. it really reflects your life. Back at, no, you have a lot of common experiences. Well, I do sparkle in the sunlight. That is true. But I was gonna say you you fell in love with vampires. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean that's what happens when you fall in love with vampires. You start sparkling in the sunlight. You become a vampire. You know how it is. You should know how it is. You, me, Deficio, we all know how it is to be a vampire. You know. And uh, so we would have Twilight movie night where we would rent the latest Twilight movie. We'd get some pizza and some beer, and we'd just hang out. Make fun of those movies all night. It was great. <laughs> it's a good, good old nerd time. That, that was just a cover for your your hidden love. We secretly your had secret boxes love. of tissues next to <laughs> us. We <laughs> pretended not to notice when one of us was crying during a particularly emotional <laughs> moment. I can remember during uh, whatever the second one was called. <laughs> Twilight That's not a two. good start. Twilight 2, the, Sparkling the, Vampire The Boogaloo. onset of night. <laughs> the onset of night, yeah. <laughs> night is coming. <laughs> really, it's almost night, Twilight 3. <laughs> Twilight 4, no, guys, it's just daylight savings time. Honest <laughs> night will be here soon. Yes, in, uh, what was it? What was it? What was the second one called? New Moon? I don't even know. I remember. have no, I, Adoa, I haven't seen these movies. I, I don't believe you. I haven't read the books. I know next to nothing about them. <laughs> You know, I'm, I appreciate that you want your fans to believe that. <laughs> the truth is going to come out eventually, you know. Uh, no, haven't seen them. We'll never see them. See, <laughs> I just prefer to defend my brain against incursions yeah. such as Twilight or the most recent Indiana Jones movie, which I Ooh. haven't seen. Yeah, that one was not, not great. Not so good. And it's too bad because it has a lot of actors that I really like, too. <laughs> but uh, that movie, not work out. I feel like Shia LaBeouf is just going to slowly become a performance artist, and I'm okay with that. I feel like he's just kind of slowly <laughs> becoming some sort of superhuman entity. I, it's great. He's transcending it? mankind, I'm pretty sure. I really love where he's been going with everything. I'm fairly certain. <laughs> oh, we're back. Oh, Overwatch again. Yes, I see.
Yeah, uh, also went out to the west. Of course, playing for Fnatic for a while. Yeah. And Whoa. The initial <laughs> suicides, and there's the nice Perfect. wave goodbye. People throw themselves into the icy water to die a hypothermic death. Is that right, Doa? It is. Uh, that's right, yeah. Hypothermic death. Although, they probably die from drowning first. I don't know about that. Well, if you're underwater for long enough. <laughs> I think you'd uh, drown before you'd freeze. I know you could at least, like, grab onto the ice and keep yourself afloat, but... Well, no, that doesn't work unless there's, like, a door from the Titanic around. We <laughs> saw... We saw Leon Leonardo DiCaprio try to do that. He needed that door. Without it, he was sunk, literally. Pun very intended. Have you noticed how all the characters, especially Lucio, are quite cheerful about the fact that they're about to go into battle and kill people and possibly die? Yeah, well, I mean... They're it's, really happy about that. It's gallows humor, you know? <laughs> I mean, it's, uh, it's a situation where you're in it, and, you know, what else can you do but smile death in the face and greet him with a breakdance, <laughs> like Lucio does. Yeah. I love that Oparochi is... Basically, Korean for Papa Roach. It is. It's, it's pretty. It's pretty good. funny. Yeah. We'll hope that's uh, that's what he means by his name. Yeah. Well, he may be a smooth criminal. What, it's I like Michael Jackson. I like Michael Jackson's <laughs> remake of that. Uh, <laughs> what, was it Papa Roach or was it some other band that did the smooth criminal remake? I, I, I don't know. I, my I, early I don't 2000s know, but anger rock. I'm sorry. <laughs> that makes me sad that somebody actually did that because Smooth Criminal is my favorite Michael Jackson song. Well, I guess I've just made you sad yet again for yet another reason. Our <laughs> <laughs> out of the kill on the lid. Welcome to King's Row. We uh, just preserved a couple of the old buildings in front of our massive futuristic skyscrapers. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. Historical preservation is important. It's though. more like a living museum where occasionally robots get assassinated. I'd rather live there than in one of those massive futuristic skyscrapers. No way, man. I'd rather live on the top floor of one of those things and then be like Batman. I would go and like stand out on the tip of the building every night with a cape and just like survey the city and be like, this is my domain. So if I take you to the top of a tall building, do you promise to stand out there on the point of something then? I already said in the last match that uh, we weren't going to do that, but... <laughs> If I, uh, you know, if I had Batman's utility belt, so I, I could get like, you one of those. Can you? Can you get me his like wings I, I, that turn into like actual wings that you can fly with? I, I can't get you things that I promise will function, but I can't oh. put you in the place where you can test them. No way, man! I need something that's proven to work. I need a bit more of a guarantee than that. You were the one talking about if you were on top of one of those buildings. I'm just trying to make your dreams a reality, Noah. Well, we all know. What happens when dreams become beings? <laughs> become uh, reality? Wrong game. You end up dead, I guess. <laughs> so that's true. <laughs> wow. That is that is a quote every uh, high school senior is going to use on their w yearbook. <laughs> when your dreams become reality, you're dead. <laughs> you end up dead. Monte Cristo 2017. Only you, Doa. It's your dreams. Oh, so my dreams have already come true. Yeah, always. Not too terribly much on the line if you're confident making it out of your group in quarterfinals, even if you are going to be in second place. I'm worried that Taimu is feeling the beat so much he's about to become a Lucio main. Yeah. <laughs> like, no Taimu, you have so much to live for. Harry Hook unbecame a Lucio main. That's he right. Had too much aim. Yeah. Well, you're not to that uh, Lucio main age yet. You have to get up there with the Internet Hall. Then it's time to, time to pick up the Lucio. <laughs> I know how you feel, man. Hang up the pistol and pick up the headphones. That's right. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's, right. What, that's what we did. <laughs> the sound blaster. Absolutely. <laughs> it's so true. It's true. You know, Lucio is really the representation of casters in the game. It's true. You know? it's, the, it's the step between, uh, between being a pro player and being a caster. <laughs> and then the retirement home. But in the meantime, there's Lucio. That's right. Well, we're starting things out on Ilios today. I feel kind of depressed now, but it's okay. Lucio's a cool, cool character, right? Right? He's cool. Yeah, he's really he's a famous DJ, though. He's very he cool. Don't worry. Yeah. Oh, there you go. <laughs> He'll never get to play another show again, though, if he <laughs> just keeps fighting. But he just can't stop killing. It's pretty grim for a DJ, actually. I know, right? When the he started dropping the bass a bit too fatly. <laughs> Welcome to Hollywood. Welcome to Offensive Widowmaker from Envy. I don't find her offensive. I think it's, <laughs> I honestly don't have a big problem. Really? Yeah. She, she's obviously, uh, you know, uh, what a ro robotic. What do you have she's, against blue people, she's, Monty she's, she's killing uh, robots, you know? Yeah, well, I mean. She's assassinating them for being pro-robot rights. You know, 
I bet. Uh, I mean, the fact that you that you don't you don't huh? consider that roboticist it says enough about you, though. Oh well, I mean, I guess my true colors are showing now. Robots should be playing music for me and running my video games. Not, not uh not preaching about robot <laughs> rights. <laughs> That's right. All right, I see how it is, Doug. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> If you can turn that widow or the Reinhardt shield, but that's a mistake too on the part of Beta Athena. You don't ever really have to turn. Okay. Okay. Well, that's that then. <laughs> Man, when Ta Taimu's Widowmaker, like uh, she looks in the mirror and goes, "When I was a girl, I was afraid of myself." <laughs> <laughs> so scary. So scary. So good. You know, it looks like that windmill has solar panels it, for. It does. Uh, that's that's see, that's a great idea. No, but that's a terrible idea because then you have to power the solar panels that are turning the the windmill, I guess, a little bit maybe. Why? But it'll be in shadow some of the time too. One can power the other, and the free energy, right? That's an unlimited energy <laughs> machine, right it's there. It's, it? it's double energy. You get the energy from the wind and the energy from the solar panels at the same time. It's and then down. you have to. For, you forgot one source of energy though. Energized by Hot Six. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. Great sponsor shout out. Thank you. Well done. Hey, you're welcome. You're welcome, Hot Six. And he's an Ana player. And who are you? Just going to start dueling with Tavik on the high ground Ninja Wars commencing. Yep. Who's going to be the real, not American Ninja Warrior? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely not that. I was going to say American Ninja Warrior, but no Americans here. <laughs> Zebesai is unloading into Miro. Wow, they're going to get the kill there. Misfits getting a few early ones here. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. But reinforced finding Eska in that back line. Looks like this Torbjorn will not be very effective on point A as Tavik gets the D suit nope. onto Zunba. Zunba desperately seeks death in the waiting arms of a ninja. And that'll be it on point A. I'm just imagining Sarah McLaughlin singing the arms of a ninja. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be dead. <laughs> Ninjas don't wrap you in their arms, usually. That's that's a boa constrictor, Monte Cristo. What are you talking about? Uh, if only we had a snake hero. <laughs> well, technically, boa constrictors don't have arms either, but <laughs> you get what I'm trying to say. You get the idea, right? That's going to get to kill the manatons. Yeah. You going to add to that? Nope. It's okay. This fight's over until <laughs> manatons comes back. I wanted so. to give you a chance. Not sure how seriously Lunatic High was playing that. Yeah, it's debatable. But, Especially uh, with that Torbjorn from Toby on point A. He's Torbjorn. <laughs> He's Torbjorn. <Yeah. laughs> Although I do love him living on top of the Pharaoh's crown. Yep. I mean, it doesn't look very comfortable up there, but... <laughs> it doesn't have to be. You can skate on any <laughs> surface if you're Lucio. You can even skate backwards now. I would take a bit of discomfort to be able to skate 20 foot up on a wall, though. That sounds pretty fun. That would be cool. You know, you can do that, though. You can I, do that. I could not personally do that. You, you could. With enough practice, you could be I just an extreme rollerblading champion. I would rather just have uh, futuristic sticky rollerblades so I could, could do it without having the same degree of skill. I'm sure somebody can Photoshop you doing sick moves on rollerblades. <laughs> somebody out there on the internet. I think we need to see what Monty Crystal would look like if he was a sick X Games gold medalist rollerblading, extreme rollerblading champion. We can hope. I don't think that's in the future. I think I'm pretty pretty much too old for that now, Doa. One can dream, though. Once you hit 30, oh. your athletic dreams are over if you're not already well underway with your career, which I am certainly not. Yeah, that's, uh, you're not, uh, you're not on your way with your career yet? I'd say you're doing My pretty well My athletic career. Oh, athletic oh, career, Doa. athletic career, okay. <laughs> don't sell yourself short, man. Not really that necessary, but. Uh, Dragon Blade. Oh, uh, okay. Channel does go down fairly early. Reinforce. Yeah, man, why not? Why not? <laughs> this dash is straight into a Reinhardt hammer. And we look at guys like Cox on that team that have been having pretty solid seasons, and you you sort of lose a little bit of hope for Fnatic in that in that regard. It's true. <laughs> it just it can't handle those can't DPS handle, players. You can't handle the Cox sometimes, you know, Doa. I was gonna say it. <laughs> you, brought it you brought it right there. <laughs> and I, always, I was trying to be very professional. Oh, uh, were you? Why bother? It's esports. <laughs> yeah. Doa, we talk about yeah. kids playing video games for a living. How serious can we possibly be? That's a good point. <laughs> We've never really tried to be very <laughs> we, serious. We haven't. Have <laughs> no. I guess that's the end of the show. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great weekend. We'll see you next week for more Overwatch action from Seoul, South Korea. Doa, Monte Cristo, Apex Season Two. See you next time. Oh, I was so close.
You weren't really close at all. <laughs> uh, I, I'm finding out. <laughs> oh, that, there we go. Bye.